Good morning everyone. It's just gone half past six in the morning. I'm dressed like a wizard. And that can mean only one thing. Today is Crep City. And this is the not quite top gear challenge. Now, my good friend Sergio Strong set me a challenge last night after we set up at Crep City. He reckons he can beat me in his car this morning as I'm getting the train. <laughs> He's got Bobbo. I've got two things on my team this morning. The first one is that Tower Bridge is closed, so he's having to take the long route. The second one is a little thing that we've got to know called Mexi time. Mexi time is like flexi time, but with a Hispanic flair. And it means that I've got a healthy boundary on my side of when he says he's going to get somewhere to when he actually gets there. So what that translates to in time-wise, usually about 25%. So if we're looking at an hour and a half journey and he says he's going to get somewhere at seven o'clock, he'll be there at half past seven. Now, luckily for me yesterday, the hour and a half journey it took him two hours and he turned up at eight o'clock. So with any luck, he's gonna suffer the same fate this morning and the train will win. Even if he leaves on time, he's gonna struggle to get in before eight o'clock, but let's wait and see. We got Nathan coming in from the other side of Essex. He's leaving at seven. And he reckons he's gonna pull in about eight. We've got Ollie coming up from coming down from North Hans. He was aiming for eight, but he hasn't left yet. And I reckon if I gave Max a little ring right about now, he'd still be in the land of slumber. Stay tuned. It's quarter to seven on a Saturday morning, which can only mean one thing. It's time for Crip City. However, I've took this idiot for a pee and a poo. So I'm in nowhere near ready to leave. So Rob, I think you might be in with a chance, but I'm pretty sure I still got this one. Well, here she is carriage that's going to take me halfway to victory. It's going to get me to Waterloo. Quick change of Waterloo to Canada Water. Canada Water. Get the over um, to Wish me luck. It's quarter past seven, so I am running probably about 25 minutes behind Rob. I'm out of the car. Just loading up the final bit. Let's see how we get on. Some stones come up over the town. And just put it into the box or mix. I have got you, mate. What's going on? So I'm in the car, camera's on, things are loaded. I need fuel, which is gonna set me back five minutes. However, I'm on my way. Rob, you better watch out. So, never done any of these little videos before, but it's about a quarter past seven on the train station, or walking to the train station, should I say. Big lorry. Uh, thoroughly amused by your videos. See you when I get there. Right, that's it. We're in Waterloo Station, and I'm running for absolutely no reason, because I know I've got this in the bag, but I thought I'd add a bit of effect to the video. Right, next stop, Jubilee Line, Canada Water. Let's go. Got you, Max. I've got you. Woo, what a load. So 
I can put my foot down, I can fly down there. I think genuinely, I mean, I'm running half an hour behind him. So he's probably gonna get there way before me, but I'll still try. Give you half a chance and stop running. Literally, I'm fucking driving like a madman. I need to get there and I need to get there quick. I can't be the last one. I can't, I'll never live it down if I am the last one. However, at this rate, it seems like I probably will be, which can't be good. It's not good. Oh, I've got the red light, I've got everything. I'm fucked. So I need to get a move on. Trying to cross the river as soon as possible because uh, yesterday I crossed over here at Chelsea Bridge. I'm close. I'm crossing the same way today. And then just going in through the city and in that way, Westminster, Big Ben, all that stuff. Because we have closure on Tower Bridge, which is normally the way we would cross directly. So we would go this side of the river directly down there and then just cross. Boom into Spitterfields but it seems that there is some roadworks or restoration or something along those lines so we cannot go down there so I'm just crossing here should be there in no time oh, say no time it's 10 to 8 <laughs> Rob's not there yet however Joe has joined in he's coming all the way from Littlehampton on the train so he's joined in on the video blogs so what I might do, I might just put all this together into one separate video and see how we all get on. However, I really need to focus. People need to get out of the way. You may have noticed the last video was cut short. Yeah, low battery. But here we are. Last stop. Shoreditch High Street. It's only down the road, isn't it, Max? Ooh. See you in a bit, mate. That's us of Parliament behind me, the Big Ben. As you might be able to see it. Literally, it's going to be such a close... Well, I like to think it's going to be a close call. I don't think it will. I think Rob's got this in the pocket. We'll see how me and Joe do. But I think uh, also Joe probably, if the trains work for him, will probably get there before me. See how it goes. Ah, oh, so close. Oh man, so fucking close. Oh, listen, listen. And if you've done your count, you know what that means. It's eight o'clock. It's eight o'clock and I'm at the Houses of Parliament. Oh my God, I'm so late. I am so late. Oh man, I, oh, I should have already sort of pretty much been there. Oh, that's a killer. That's such, such a killer. But one does try and my excuse is I had to walk the dog. That's not an excuse. Oh, man. Fuck. Hey. We tried, right? Super tried. Genuinely, actually, fully tried. I mean, I could have woke up a bit earlier. But I did wake up actually earlier. But I just took my time getting ready. I didn't even have a coffee. I can't even blame it on taking my time having a coffee. I've had no news from Rob yet, so I might still be in with a shout, but I doubt it. I really All right, really so it. in East London now. Almost there, sat nav says eight minutes. 
literally no traffic that so should be very close to those eight minutes so I'm looking about quarter past eight because it's five past eight now which would mean roughly that 55 minute journey including refuel I think that's pretty good all right on commercial street which means I'm literally here Spitterfields is just in front of me but I, I mean it's 13 minutes past 8 so including a fuel stop I think in time in door to door like I was saying before I've won but who knows I'm, oh, I'm am I even like I mean I'm not nervous who gives a fuck but it's quite fun I don't think uh, I don't think I've won if I'm brutally honest I don't think I'm one but we'll see I'm just gonna go straight to park up and see how things go oh my god the entrance is just there coffee shops just there <sighs> See how we get on. So glad I. Well, we, I say we set out with fucking put shoes on tables. That's not sitting up. I do, my man. You good? Thanks, yeah. Okay. okay. On park. Whatever will be, will be. Let's go. It's at times like these that I like to quote one of my favourite poets, Stormzy. Stormzy once said, Mex try say he's quicker than me. Tell that Mac Mex, shut up. See you in a bit, mate. <laughs> Okay, it's certain that I must have lost. I'm just walking through bag and stuff. I've got to have lost, surely. We're in. I'm in. It's a lot busier than last night. Oh shit, look who it is. Yo. <laughs> Fucking prick is videoing me. I knew it. I knew he'd get here before me, but hey. It's the winner's smile. It's the winner's smile. The winner's smile. It's the winner's smile. <laughs> what time is it? Oh, man. Kill what time it's... is it? Let's have a little look, Siri. Oh, half past eight. Are you oh. quite sure? <laughs> you won't be doing that challenge again, mate. Peace.